As the vehicle burns its engines, that will push us back up. And because we're going engine first, that will slow us down and decelerate the vehicle. Those quick puffs you're seeing are cold FBS gas thrusters that are there to make minor attitude or position corrections on the vehicle. Stage one entry startup. And that footage is being sent down from onboard cameras in space. So you can see through the choppiness there that the entry burn has started. Remember, 20 second burn in total for the re entry. Stage one entry burn shut down. And the entry burn has concluded. As you can see, the exhaust there on the left side. Now we're going to go into the second of the two plan burns, the landing burn soon. But it's worth noting that we'll have a very short sequence here as well. While the landing burn is occurring, second stage is going to conclude its first of two burns. So you'll see the landing burn start on the left side of your screen. And then you'll see the second stage stop firing on the right side of your screen. And then about 20 seconds after, you'll see the left stage hopefully come down with zero velocity on the surface of the drone ship. Landing burn start. Seco number one, landing bird conclusion. And we're about 30 seconds out again. Landing burn, Seco one, one, and then landing conclusion. That feed is intermittent. If it does come back, it Stage will show up in PIP on guidance. screen. Stage two, FTS is saved. Landing bird startup. And there was Seco. You caught it at the very end there. Don't know exactly what's happening with the landing, but we'll report back for that as soon as we have the information. But you saw that blip there stage at the one end where deployed. Seco one, second engine cutoff number one, did occur where the second stage stopped firing. We're going to check some data and tune in on first stage here in a second. Orbital insertion. All right, landing shut down. And there it is. The first stage has landed on the drone ship. Of course, I still love you in the Atlantic Ocean for another recovery and a potential third refurbished flight of this same booster.